What is going on, everybody? It is your boys, Sir MC Coy, and we are back again with week two of your Cardinals franchise. Now, I'm going to warn you guys, I am a little sick, as is pretty evident by my voice, so I'm probably going to sound funky throughout this whole video, but I've been sick since Monday. I wanted to have this video out a lot earlier, so I'm just saying screw it, and I'm doing the voice, and I'm getting this out to you guys. Focusing on the matchup, the Cardinals have their first NFC West matchup against the LA Rams, a very dangerous opponent. That offense is getting there, but that defense, arguably one of the top defenses in the league, something we gotta look out for, for sure. The Cardinals won the toss and chose to defer to the second half, so we will see Jared Goff come out, coming off a four interception performance in week one. I guess there's one quarterback in the league that threw more picks than Josh Rosen. Goff will start on first down. Going play action, and it's going nowhere. Marcus Golden is right in the face of Jared Goff on first down. Beautiful. Second down and 18 now. Goff throwing over the middle. Finds his tight end, Tyler Higby. It'll be close to a first down. Well, not really. Third down and eight. Goff, play action again. Under pressure, throwing to the right side, and Patrick Peterson breaks up the pass. He was looking for Higby yet again. Now we'll see the Cardinals offense, led by rookie Josh Rosen. Almost a 300-yard performance in week one, but three interceptions to go along. We already know that's going to be a problem. we got to tone those down. So now we'll see what the Cardinals offense can get done against this dangerous Rams defense. Second down is just a dump off underneath to Jermaine Gresham. It's going to have to be a lot of safe passes here for Josh Rosen. On third and four, he tries to float one outside looking for J.J. Nelson. But that pass is just too far out. Rams now will start from their own three-yard line as the fullback Brown gets the carry up to the seven. Take a look at this Rams offense. Pretty solid up front, but what you really need to worry about is the young weapons. Gurley, Cooks, Robert Woods, they've got Cooper Cup, and of course, Jared Goff. Third down and three, we'll see Goff throwing and a little off the mark. So after this punt, the Rams should start with decent field position. They'll go play action on first down. Goff, sensing pressure, gets it off. There's Larry Fitzgerald, good for a first down and a little bit more. Two of three starts Josh Rosen on the day. First down, now they'll go handoff to David Johnson, and he has nowhere to go. Michael Brockers in on the tackle. Second down and 12, play action again for Rosen. We've taken a deep shot, and there's J.J. Nelson close to midfield. Nice throw from Rosen. Let's see if he can settle into a groove here. First and 10 again, Rosen to Nelson underneath, using his speed to get the edge, and another first down for the Cardinals. Now we'll take a look at this vaunted defense. And Adama can sue Aaron Donald and Brockers up front. You've got to be kidding me. The linebacker core is probably the weakest spot, but still has some playmakers. And, of course, the secondary. Peters, Tlaib, and Joyner. Oh, my God. New Legion of Boom. Second down. Handoff goes to David Johnson. And Johnson pulls through a defender on his way to a first down. That's why I love David Johnson. He's always falling forward. Empty set, second down and 10 for Rosen, who runs out of time. Abukum will get to the quarterback. That is a sack. Third down and 16 now, Rosen. Trying to get a throw off. They bring the corner blitz, and there's Nikel Roby Coleman getting the pressure and getting the sack. We're still pointless here, more than midway through the first. Gurley tries to make a move, and he's met by Benson Mayoa. Coming off a strong performance in week one, nearly 100 yards and a touchdown. Let's see if we can prevent that from happening again. It's on third and seven. Jared Goff just gets rid of it, so another three and out for the Rams. Still looking for their first first down of the game. Rosen throws on first down. What a hit laid down by Marcus Peters. Thankfully, Nelson holds on and gets himself a first. Handoff now goes to Johnson up the middle. There's good enough for a gain of three. Third down and five, Rosen to the air, looking to the outside, caught by Larry Fitzgerald inside the 35. The Cardinals are moving. These quick passes are definitely working for him as now there goes David Johnson down inside the 20 yard line. Liking what I'm seeing from Arizona on this drive. First down and 10. 
Rosen lobbing one up into double coverage. It's going to be intercepted by Mark Barron. The rookie mistakes continue as this scoring drive gets nothing. First and 10 Rams. Goff is taken down. Marcus Golden comes in and gets the sack. Big loss on first down, leading to a third and 19. Goff back to throw under pressure again. The ball comes out and it's in the end zone. And it's kicked out of the back of the end zone for a Cardinals safety. Let's go. 2 nothing Arizona now. Interesting score. As on first down, there's a little dump off to rookie Christian Kirk. He tries to make a move, but doesn't get much. Third and four, another blitz coming, and it is Nikel Roby Coleman again on the corner blitz, getting to Rosen. We'll see the Rams take back over, still looking for their first first down. They'll get kind of close here, but it is still second and inches. Handoff will go to Gurley, and he is swallowed up immediately by Hassan Reddick. It's third and one. Will they pick up a first here? Goff, play action. He's taken down by Corey Peters. And the Cardinals defense still holding the Rams without a first down. And we're in the second quarter. First and 10 now for the Cardinals as Jermaine Gresham bowls through a would-be tackler. Picking up a first down. Second down and 12. Handoff going to David Johnson. He's taken down by a couple of Rams defenders. Short game. Leading to a third and nine now. Rosen. Good protection. That pass is swatted down at the line by Sue. Christian Kirk was wide open over the middle. We'll see the Rams take over again with not good field position. And Gurley's going backwards yet again. It's Antoine Bethea in the backfield. Eye formation on second down and 12. They're just trying to get it out of the shadow of their end zone. Gurley running the wrong way. He's going to lose more yards. Bethea again on the tackle. Third down and 14. This is dangerous as Gurley gets the handoff. Spinning. Gurley still on his feet and finally tripped up. Almost picks up a first down there. But it is not meant to be. So we'll see the Cardinals taking over again as Rosen tries to set up the screen for Johnson and does. He gets a decent chunk of yards. He had Aaron Donald all turned around. On second down, carry now for Johnson. Taken to the left side, getting very close to the first down. It'll be third and one. Tackled from behind by Sue. Third down, carry goes right back to David Johnson. Falling forward for first down yardage. We'll move the chains into Rams territory. Rosen now throwing on first and 10. Great protection finds Christian Kirk over the middle inside the 30 yard line. 12 of 17 starts Rosen with 117 yards. Second down pressure but Rosen gets the throw off it's tipped and falls harmlessly to the ground nice defense there by Roby Coleman leading to a third and nine play action to Chase Edmonds Rosen again great protection missing on the throw for Larry he was close to the first down marker so the Cardinals settle for a field goal it is now a five nothing game Rams back out on the field looking for their first first down of the game uh, again this one will be close but is inches shy Empty set as Goff throws, and there it is. Finding Robert Woods, the Rams, with four minutes left to go in the second half, have finally moved the chains. Goff throwing here on second down. There's Tyler Higby, his tight end. Good for a first. Starting to string a couple together. This is still a five-point game, despite how pretty dominant this has been on the Cardinals side. So the Rams well, moving into scoring territory now. Second down and 10 for Goff. Under pressure, gets it out for Cooper Cup. He's taken down almost immediately by Jamar Taylor. That'll lead to a third and four. Goff throwing to the outside for Higby. He's taken down immediately by Buddha Baker. That'll bring out the field goal unit. And they're going to go for a fake. Zurline rolls out and is taken down. I don't know why they would try for something as foolish as that. But that will take us to the half. The score remaining 5 nothing Cardinals. This is still really anybody's game. We'll have to see how things pan out in the second half. Thank you guys so much for watching up to this point. If you haven't already, go check out my Patreon. All the tiers are low, low, low for just $2 a month. You can find yourself as a drafted player and be seen in this franchise. I mean, that's pretty cool. Way to see yourself giving back. Other tiers, you can play games with me and get in on the Discord. Check it out.
At halftime, we will check out some of the divisional matchups. The 49ers, who are currently 1-0, are tied with the 0-1 Lions going into half. Let's get back into the second half. Let's not waste any time. Cardinals do start with the ball and a good chance to really open up their lead is David Johnson. A nice run. Cuts it to the outside then makes a move. Easy pickup of five. Now third and five though as Rosen's under pressure. They brought the linebacker blitz. Wilson gets in there and brings him down. So three and out go the Cardinals. Let's see if our defense can three and out the Rams again. Goff throwing over the middle complete to Woods. Close to a first down. Now third and one. Handoff goes Gurley's direction and Gurley is swallowed up. Chandler Jones bringing him down in the backfield. His defense has really just been impressing him all day. So Cardinals take back over and there goes David Johnson. Lots of open space and always fighting for extra yards. He's up over 50. First and 10. Rosen throws into the flats for Jermaine Gresham again. But not a lot going there. Second down, single back is Johnson. He will take the carry, and David Johnson breaks away from first contact. We'll get close to the first down. They're going to mark it third and inches. Hand up going David Johnson's way, and he is stuffed. They'll end up losing yard. Fourth and one, the offense choosing to stay out here. A risky play call, but David Johnson puts the ball on the ground, recovered by Aaron Donald. He had picked up the first down, but fumbles. But now we're going to see a review here. You see knee down, elbow down, then the ball comes out. This is a Cardinals first down. Really got lucky there. Because now here comes David Johnson again, fighting for yardage. Picking up about seven. Second down and three. Rosen, play action pass. Good protection, airing one out there is Larry Fitzgerald, turning up close to the 20 yard line. Beautiful throw from Rosen. Second down and 10, handoff, David Johnson, he's tripped up from behind by Sue. He had some room in front of him and some blockers. That'll lead to a third and five. Rosen, again to the air, feeling the pressure, dumps it off for JJ Nelson with space, tries to dive for it. He's taken down at the two. First and goal, Cardinals. Rosen to the air, squeezes it into Larry Fitzgerald. And the Cardinals have their first touchdown of the game. And they will be going up 12-0 now on the Rams. Still just a two-possession game as they go out throwing on first down. Goff finds Brandon Cooks for the first time this game. Five minutes to go in the third quarter. We'll see Goff handing it off to Gurley. He fights for a, maybe a yard or two, but brought down very handily by Dion Buchanan. Third down and nine, shotgun with Gurley to the right. Goff, good protection, but it's starting to run out. He's hit as he throws. There's nothing going, and the Rams have to punt. The Cardinals can score on this drive. They can really open things up as Ndamukong Sue gets into the backfield for the first time, sacking Josh Rosen. So third and 16, play action again. Rosen lobbing one up, looking for J.J. Nelson, and he's got it. The speedster beats two men deep, and Arizona moves to the L.A. Rams 38-yard line. Beautiful play as they face another third down. Rosen again back to pass, firing one in, trying to hit Bryce Butler. It's swatted away nicely. So Arizona gets the field goal now to make this a 15-point game. Gurley, again, just nowhere to go. 11 rushes for 12 yards. He has been struggling against our defense. Third down and 10. Goff back to throw. Firing over the middle. There's his tight end, Tyler Higby, who has definitely been his favorite target thus far. On second down, again, it's Goff to the air. This time, it's Cooper Cup over the middle. Not a lot, but setting up an easier third down and six. Off to the air. There is Tyler Higby again as we are really struggling to cover him today. He'll move the chains pretty handily. Two minutes into the fourth quarter, the Rams still looking for their first points of the day as Goff fires one out. There's Brandon Cooks down to the 12-yard line. Here we go. First and 10. Goff hit as he throws, finds Gurley, and Gurley losing three yards. Nice open field tackle by Buda Baker. 
Second down and 13. Gurley breaking off of one, spinning away, and this is what Todd Gurley can do. He's been silenced all day. That run will actually double his yard total, but all it takes is one. The Rams now made this an eight-point game. David Johnson is just blown up by Brockers. What a hit. Second down and 11, going back to David Johnson. Donald strips it out, luckily recovered by the right tackle, Mason Cole. That's two forced fumbles now from Aaron Donald. Third and six now for the Cardinals. Throwing to the outside for Kirk. He will be well shy of the first down marker. Cardinals punt. Now if the Rams can put together another good scoring drive, this could be considered a close game. Robert Woods over the middle, Pat Pete in coverage, he gets the tackle, but a first down regardless. Empty set for Goff now on first down. Good protection, there's Woods underneath, makes a move past one man, and then is taken down close to the first down marker. We'll call it second and one. Handoff now goes to Gurley, he picks up the first down, not a lot more. Brought down by Corey Peters. Just 28 yards on the day for Gurley. First and 10, Goff finding Higby. Oh my god, what a tackle from Golden. I can't believe Higby held on to that. Third down and one now. Will they hand it off to Gurley? They do. No, it's play action. Goff fires over the middle. Wide open, Brandon Cooks. The defense bit hard on the play action. Inside scoring territory, now it's Goff. Underneath for Cooper Cup, and that has really just been Cooper Cup's... Uh, Wheelhouse, underneath, short gains. Third and five, Goff. Firing over the middle, Robert Woods complete again inside the 15-yard line. Four minutes to go, the Rams looking to equalize things as Gurley goes right side, maybe three yards, not a lot going for him. Second down and seven, Gurley again beside Goff, and it'll be another handoff as he's taken down after a gain of four, nice tackle by Chandler Jones. Third down and three. Goff to the air, rolling to the outside. Goff fires it, swatted, nearly intercepted by Hassan Reddick. They're going for it on fourth down here. Fake handoff, Goff with the rollout. Now rolls left, plants, throws. He's got Anthony Everett, the tight end in the back corner of the end zone. The Rams are just a two-point conversion away from tying this. There was two Cardinals there, but neither were able to get there before the ball did. And now they'll come out for the two-point conversion. Goff, good protection, firing back corner of the end zone. He's got Robert Woods, and we've got a tie game with less than three minutes to go. All right, Josh Rosen, what can you do? David Johnson, good job shaking off first contact. He gets three yards. Closing in on the two-minute warning, it'll be another handoff to David Johnson, who picks up first down yardage for the Cardinals as we do hit the two-minute warning. First and 10, now it's gonna be Rosen throwing. Oh, a tight throw, but complete to Christian Kirk. Nice throw from Rosen. First and 10, Rosen. Throwing now left side, swatted away by Nikel Roby Coleman. No, sorry, that was Mark Barron making the play. Larry Fitz, the intended receiver. Second down and 10, pressure coming, and down goes Rosen. It is going to be a third down and 19, a big play upcoming. Less than a minute. Rosen steps up in the pocket, fires downfield, complete to Larry Fitzgerald. What a throw from Rosen. Cardinals take their first time out with 49 seconds to go. Rosen throws now underneath for Gresham, who gets away from first contact, and he fights to get close to field goal territory. They're definitely on the fringe of it now. Second down and one, David Johnson picks up the first down. Not a lot but picks it up. Second down and four now, just trying to run things out. David Johnson will get him even better field position. As now, the attempt for the game-winning field goal. Blair Walsh with the kick, and the Cardinals win in week two in walk-off fashion. What a game. The Rams tried to come back in this one, but the Cardinals had the last possession, and they made it count. Beautiful. 18 to 15 is your final score. Your Cardinals over the LA Rams who now fall to 0 and 2. Not how the Rams are looking to open the season. Looking at the stats for Rosen, 263 yards, a touchdown, and a pick. Not bad. David Johnson breaks 100 yards for the first time this season. That's what you like to see. 
JJ Nelson, again, another 100 yard day. Larry Fitzgerald, 73 yards and a touchdown. And then, you know, just some guys with few receptions, but not a lot of yards to go with them. On the defensive side, Dion Buchanan with nine tackles, seven for Jamar Taylor. Got a few, you know, tackles on the backfield. And sacks by Peters, Campbell, Hassan Reddick, and Marcus Golden. No turnovers on the day. We had a forced fumble from Reddick, but it went nowhere. Looking at someone who can use some improvement, we got left tackle DJ Humphreys, a 77 overall. He is a power style, but we want him to be a scheme fit, so we will get more experience. So we are going to go with the agile, try to see if we can get him to be a scheme fit. And he is almost there. NFC West, 49ers up 2-0. The Jimmy G era is for real. Cardinals and Seahawks at 1-1 and the Rams at 0-2. We've got some contracts that need to be signed, and David Johnson is an obvious one. We want David Johnson back, so we will do that very quickly after looking at these Player of the Weeks. Nothing fancy there. David Johnson. You want to stay in Arizona? Five years, $63 million, and David Johnson is signed. Larry Fitzgerald wants two. I'd like to see if we can get him on a one-year, and Larry Fitzgerald is having none of that, so we'll have to go back to it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you've watched up to this point, remember, leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Especially leave a like. That helps so much. And if you haven't already, check out that Patreon. Really cool offers. Thank you guys. I'll see you next week as we face the Bears. Back, back, back from the dead.